Welcome to Earth and Owl. I'm Nikki and back by popular demand is my grandma Helen. We're going to be doing a little beginners active agers workout for you here today. So hope you can join us. All right, let's start with our feet about hip width distance apart. And we're going to start with just a little health bounce. So lifting those heels, keeping the balls of your feet on your trampoline mat. Before we do anything, we always want to check in with our form and our core. So Take your awareness to your midsection, really think about engaging those muscles, drawing your navel back towards your spine and keeping those muscles nice and tight. Does that make sense to you? Yes. Okay. So, perfect. So we're just lifting our heels here, getting warmed up a bit. We're going to do a few leg movements, then we're going to add in some arms and maybe mix it up and do a few combinations. All sure. right. Couple deep breaths. Now, let's keep our left hand on the bar. Take your right hand down by your side. We're going to take a few deep breaths here. So, big inhale, reach this right arm all the way up. And exhale, take it down. Switch arms. Left hand down, here we go. Big breath in. And out. One more time, each side. Right side. And left side. Perfect. Now bring that awareness back to your core. Make sure you're still engaging those abdominal muscles here. All right, let's move into a little jog. Now we're going to keep the balls of our feet on the trampoline and just bend one knee at a time. There you go. Just like we're walking down the street. Does that make sense? Yes, that sounds good. Okay. So if you are hanging on to a bar here, you can continue to do so or even maybe swing one arm. Give that a try. Going for our walk. Now, if you need a little bit more of a moderate intensity level, certainly you could pick the feet up off the trampoline. So this workout today is going to be um, easily modified for whatever level you're at. Very good. Now you can see that my grandma here is wearing tennis shoes on her trampoline and she has the jump sport balance and stability bar attached. I prefer to go in bare feet or grippy socks and generally don't use a bar. So there's lots of ways you can make the workout work for you. All right, let's go back to that health bounce. So balls of feet on the trampoline, lifting our heels. Very good. All right, now from here, we're going to take one foot to the side at a time. So we're going to do right foot, then left foot, right foot, then left foot, right, then left. We're kind of preparing here for some jumping jacks, right? <laughs> you can do it. <laughs> Modified jumping jacks. <laughs> All right. Keep going. Let's keep at this for a minute or so. Perfect. Right, then left. Right, then left. Let's get about eight more of these. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Back to your health bounds, just lifting the heels. You got it. Now we're going to do that same thing, but we're only going to do one leg at a time. Okay, so we're going to go right, 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 right. Kind of have to get a rhythm, a cadence. Perfect, you got it. Now keep your left hand on the bar there and bring your right hand down. Right, right. How you doing? I'm oh, wonderful. Good. <laughs> well, my left calf muscle is really burning at this point. So is mine. Yes, we're getting a good calf workout here. All right, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, back to your health bounce, lifting the heels. Just a gentle health bounce. I like that one. Yeah, deep breath. Okay, so now we're gonna do that on the left side. Right hand on the bar, left hand down at your side. Yep, left, you got it, left. So I think of this movement as kind of a modified jumping jack, wouldn't you say? I think so. Uh -huh. We want to get that right calf muscle burning just the way we did the left. It's starting to. Yep. Arm 
with your like, perfect. Yep, you got it. <laughs> oh, come on. All right, here we go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Back to your health bounds. Whew. Okay, let's yeah. shake it out a minute. Let's shake it out. Just relax. Shake your arms out. Take a deep breath. Okay, we're going to put that together now. So we'll do right, then left. <laughs> right, then we'll do it. Then left. I know you can do it. <laughs> okay. So let's take it slow first through. And let's take the bounce out a little bit so it's a little less complicated. So we've got our hands on the bar here. We're going to go right, then left. Right, then left. And if you feel confident and comfortable, bringing hand out. Hand out. So right, then left. You got it, right? Then left, right, left. Perfect. Then, you know, like I said, you can take the bounce out of it to, to simplify a little bit. And then when you feel like you've got that rhythm, you can add a little more bounce to this. Look how in sync we are. Aren't we doing well? We are. <laughs> You're getting a lot better every day. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so let's finish this up here. A couple more sets. How about 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10. See how I can count? Two, yeah, seven, I taught you six, five, four, three, two, one. Back to your health balance, lifting those heels. Now, one thing we may have kind of lost track of is are we keeping that core engaged? Oh, right. Yeah. So keep drawing navel back to spine, make sure you're engaging all those muscles of your midsection. It makes a lot of difference, doesn't it? It does. Yeah. Okay, so from here, we're going to do a little twist. So we're going to shake our hips side to side. Now, see how my feet are shifting? It's like my heels are, there you go. Perfect. I remember the twist. I was just going to ask. <laughs> it's not very good at it, but I remember. It's fun. You know what's really funny to think about? So we're filming this right now in um, a commercial building that I own. And many, many years ago, this was a dance hall, right? Yes, downstairs. Yeah. yeah. So the downstairs, which, which has been a yoga studio the last few years, what, what was it, 1950s? Uh, late 50s. Late 50s was the dance hall. So here's grandma, however many years later that is, 20. <laughs> doing the twist. All right. All right, let's take a little break here. So we're gonna, we've been, we've been doing some arm movements. We're gonna add a few more in. If you have any shoulder issues, grandma has had shoulder surgery before. So you, so you might notice that, you know, she lifts one arm a little higher or something like that. So always modify to what works best for you, especially if you've had any injuries. So let's start with that health bounce again, lifting our heels. And we're gonna do a right punch into the air. So it'll go right, right, right. Now, as we really add in these big arm movements, again, make sure you're drawing navel towards spine. How's that feel? Good. Okay. Are you making a fist or not? I am. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Let's get a couple sets of this. 16, 15, 14. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Let's go to the left side. Left, left. You could always punch forward too if that was better. I think it is. Okay. I need surgery on that one to make it as good as the other one. <laughs> this one is not so good. Well, you've got a bad shoulder and I've got a knee that gives me some uh -oh. trouble sometimes. All right, let's get a couple more sets in here on the left. 16, 15, 13, 12, 11, 12, 13, 12, 13, 12, 13, 12, 13, 12, 13, 12, 13, 12, 13, 12, 13, 12, 13, 12, 13, 12, 13, 12, 13, 12, 13, 12, 13, 12, 13, 12, 13, 12, 13, 12, 13, 12, 13, 12, 13, 12, 13, 12, 13, 12, 13, 12, 13, 12, 13, 12, 13, 12, 13, 12, 13
What we're gonna do next is combine those two. So we'll go right, then left. Okay. All right, so let's get our health bounce going. In four, three, two, right punch right here. Right, then left. Right, then left. Good job, look at you. No hands. <laughs> Why there's eight counts in a set? No. 
it's musical. So in most music, there's uh, eight counts to mm -hmm. each, not measure, there's usually four counts per measure, but in there, it's like it's on an eight count cycle. So to match music, a lot of times sure. we go eight counts. Okay, let's come back to our twist. Hips and we kind of shuffle our feet. Twist, you got it. All right, we've been going about 15 minutes. Good, how so, long is this? All right. Oh. <laughs> No, we're actually wrapping it up here pretty quick. So, uh, Grandma and I have another workout on YouTube um, or on the streaming service that you can check out if you haven't already. And I have lots of workouts for beginners, seniors, and of course, active. Um, I have level two, level three, more challenging, high intensity workouts as well. You can follow Earth and Owl on Facebook. I have a private Facebook group where I post videos and whatnot. So, hope you'll check that out. Grandma, are you going to come back for another workout? Sure. <laughs> that was an awfully delayed reaction there. <laughs> well, I, I don't have a lot of breath. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, so let's wrap this up. We'll do two more sets of twists here. 16, 15, 14, 13. Last set. Eight, seven, six, five, four. Three, two, one. All right, let's get some cool down breaths in here. So right hand comes down. We take a big inhale, sweep that up. Exhale, other side. Ooh, that went way up that time. <laughs> other side. Just never know what. Good. And left. All right. Thank you for joining us here today. We had a great time. Hope you had a great time. We'll see you next time.